Hello and welcome to Invision News. This is Atnagar sharing the information about city and around. The news in detail. The ambitious Indirida Samrada Balasa Thakre Mahamaharashtra Samrudhi Mahamara will prove to be the best highway in the country. The first phase of this ambitious project that is going to bring prosperity to Nagpur, Vardha, Amravati, Washim, Bundana districts of Vidarbha will be completed by around May 1st and will be open for direct traffic, said Chief Minister Thakre. Thakre reviewed the work of the 47 km of Samrudhi Highway in Vidarbha. The Chief Minister also inspected the 6 km highway at Shivni Rasulpur village in the district and expressed satisfaction about progress of the work. Cabinet Minister Eknath Shinde, Advocate Yashumati Thakur, Sanjay Rathor, Divisional Commissioner P.O. Shailesh Naval, District Collector Amor Yedge, Chief Executive Officer Dr. Hari Balaji N and others were present on the occasion. Earlier in the day, he was welcomed at the Nagpur airport by several officials from the district administration. The embryo biotechnology laboratory would help farmers in the state to increase milk production of milking cows of farmers, said a Minister of Animal Husbandry and Dairy Development, Sunit Kedar, on Saturday. Kedar was addressing the inaugural function of embryo biotechnology laboratory set up in the city under Rashtri Gopal Mission. Union Minister Nitin Gadgi presided over. ZP Chairman of Agriculture and Animal Husbandry, Tapishwar Vaidya, Vice Chancellor of Maharashtra Agriculture and Fisheries Science University, Dr. Ashish Paturkar, Dr. A.P. Somkwar, Dr. N.V. Kurkure, Dr. B. Rao, T.S. Raghuvanshi, M.M. Mavaskar, Dr. Sudhir Dudalwar, and Sudhir Dewey were also present. The Maharashtra government is constantly working for the upliftment of farmers, milk production and other supportive business would help the farmer to increase their standard of living. God, rearing, milk production, meat production, etc. would help the farmers to increase their earnings. The second capital of the state on December 5 reported 527 fresh positive cases in the day. The tally has now surged to 1,14,218. The continuous spike in the cases and Fallen recovery rate from last few weeks continues in the city, putting civic authorities in trouble. Today, 339 persons became free of the infection, taking the cumulative number of recovered cases to 1,4738, including 56,717 from isolation recoveries. With the less recoveries, the recovery rate is also dropping down. Today, it stands at 91.70%. Meanwhile, 10 persons succumbed to the infection in the day, taking the total count of fatality to 3,724. From the total deaths, 2,560 deaths are that of patients hailing from the city, and while 643 patients are originally from rural areas of the district, and the remaining 521 patients are from outside Nagpur, an official release site. On behalf of the Uttar Nagpur Congress Committee, Minister of State for Energy of Maharashtra and Initiative of Garjin, Minister of Nagpur District, Dr. Nitin Raut, a victory rally was organized by Congress activists. The rally was hailed from Bajan Bhak to Indira Chowk. At this time, the activists celebrated the victory by bursting firecrackers and playing toll and distributing sweets. Indian National Congress office bearers and activists Raja Jikarwade, Bandu Panjit, Temburne, Thakurji Jagyasi, Haribhav Kirpane, Ratnakar Jaipurkar, Philip Cheswal, Suresh Patel, Deepak Khobra Gade, Mulchan Meher, Sahib Rao Shirsat, Karpurter, Parshram Mavatkar, Dinesh Yadav, Varsha Shampule, Mahendra Vaan, Bandu Tarvekar, Sunil Banerji, Suresh Jagyasi, Mahendra Borkar, Hira Ginam, Geeta Shrivas, Masur Khan Ajit Singh, Subhash Mishram, Sheshra Vasnik, Vijay Hazare, Satish Patel, Gautam Bade and many others were present during the celebration. Earlier in the day, Two, Advocate Abhijit Vajjari was felicitated by INC activists. The NDPS square of the crime branch of Nagpur Police raided Hotel Nirvana situated on Amravati Road on Friday night. Alcohol was being made available to the consumers illegally here. Police registered a case against three people including the director of the hotel. The accused persons are Randaspet resident Gurjit Singh Brijinder Singh Chopra, Gurpreet Singh Madan Singh Chopra and Gurinder Singh Brijinder Singh Chopra. Police learned that the liquor was being sold illegally at Hotel Nirvana near Maruti Showroom and Amravati Road. Liquor was available even to customers who came to the hotel without license. Based on this information, the police team raided the location. Gurinder was seen selling liquor from the counter with the help of hotel staff. Police raided the counter and seized goods worth Rs 5,439, including bottles of whiskey, rum and beer, for the probes underway. As part of Swachh Sarvekshan 2020, on behalf of all the 10 zones of Nagpur Municipal Corporation, a cleanliness rally was organized on Saturday to create awareness among the people. 
In order to bring Nagpur city among the top 10 cities in the country in the survey, Municipal Commissioner Radhakrishnan B has appealed to all concerned NMC employees to make efforts and try to take the city to as high as ranking possible. Nagpur was earlier ranked 58, but last year Nagpur's ranking improved to 18. All the zonal assistance commissioner, health officers and sanitization employees are working to achieve ranking within top 10 this year. On Saturday, all the sanitization officers and employees held cleanliness awareness rallies in their respective zones. Street plays were performed in Gandhi Park and citizens were appealed to separate wet and dry waste during this pause. Well, that's all from this bulletin. For more updates in and around the city, stay tuned with NBC News. Till then, Ratnakar says goodbye. Please take very good care of yourself and family.